About 10 years ago, my dad made this baseball-themed bed for my son, and I just went through and fixed it and replaced a bunch of hardware, and now my grandson's going to use it. So this, this little bed here, will mean something to four generations. Hey, it's Brock here from Rock Hill Farms, and I had no intention of filming a video today. I've already got a video scheduled to upload tomorrow, but I was out here working, and I decided that this little tool I bought this afternoon is so cool I just had to say something. It's not like, wow, that's life-changing or anything like that, but I might say it's the best $10 tool I ever bought. Let's get a battery on here and show you what I'm talking about. I think most guys who like to work on stuff have an impact driver like this. Use it as a screw gun most of the time. These drivers, I think, are lo a lot better than a cordless drill for running screws. That's just my opinion on it. So, if we've already got one of these, I think we should have one of these kits right here. And I've been using it the last 30 minutes, so it's all spread out. But I was just walking through Home Depot, and I saw these little right angle tools in a package. There's five pieces in this. I was like, I'm not sure exactly what the five pieces are, but I can clearly tell that it lets you run things at a right angle with two different types of tools. I thought that's really handy. And so I just bought it, it's 10 bucks. And now that I check it out, this is super handy. So this can go together in a lot of configurations. If you want your right angle tool to be up close like this, you can put these little twist handles on it and there's little tabs here you line up right there and then when you twist it get this up close so you can see it clicks in now it's secure you take that tab push it up to take it off then now you've got these little screw in handles that can go on either side like that to control the head and this will let you get in a really small space. Now, we've got the same thing right here for a socket. That one, you put a screwdriver bit in it, a Torx bit, nut driver, I've been using this stack of nut drivers here. I'm fixing this bed for my grandson for Christmas. And I didn't just buy these on a whim, but I was thinking while I was there that the type of screw I want to use, which has this hex head in it and is a little bit long, it was going to be hard to run those screws in this tight space. And I'll show you in just a minute. So then here's the second right angle tool with the little handle. Pretty handy, don't have to use the handle if you don't want to. Those are kind of a secondary way to use it, but also either of the 90 degree heads, I think I'll go ahead and use the one with the socket on it, either of those 90 degree heads can clip into this instead and give you a little bit more reach, but you're still short in this direction. So pop that in, it doesn't get much easier than that, but it's a nice little modular system. Clip it in here. And what this does is replaces an air ratchet or an, a cordless electric ratchet or any kind of tool like that. I was helping my father-in-law work on my daughter's car and he had a little air ratchet. I keep calling it an air ratchet because for years I used air ratchets. But it was an electric, cordless electric ratchet. And... I was like, man, I need to get one of those. But buying a new tool is 100 bucks or something. This is now a clumsier version, but also a really tight-fitting version of that for 10 bucks. So this is my grandson's bed, and it was falling apart. So they brought it to me, and it's got the wrong hardware being used in the wrong places to hold it together. And like the screws that go in right here, let me bring the camera over so you can see. These screws right here, are little stubby screws with a fat head on them and they're Phillips head 
but whoever ran them in couldn't get a good angle to put them in, so they ran them. They kind of toenailed these little short screws in, and these were falling off. Now I've already fixed the other side. I'm going to show you the difference a little tool like this can make. So every once in a while, a $10 tool will make your day. And that's the case for me with this little thing. Not a big deal, really. I just thought it was cool. I'll find a link to these and put it in the description of the video. It's not like a right angle drill is groundbreaking. DeWalt didn't just invent this. I had a right angle drilling attachment in my toolbox 25 years ago when I was doing factory work. But just the form factor of this and the price, pretty darn good. And the fact it's got interchangeable heads, because if you had to put a socket adapter in to this head, now it's going to stick out further. So, love the little innovation. Just thought I'd share it with you guys. Since it's the week of Christmas, I hope you guys are all having a great holiday season. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.